They're back! Welcome back to Velocity and surprise surprise it is the return of one of the best modern tag teams to ever grace NXT. American Alpha are back and they are taking on the World Tag Team Champions Gallows and Anderson in a World Tag Team Championship match which is coming at your faces right now. So. If you are ready, willing and able to see some of the best tag team action in wrestling today, stay tuned and stick around. We keep those title matches coming at you thick and fast and the tag team championships are about to be defended right now. American Alpha making their return as a tag team. Chad Gable and Jason Jordan On the way to the ring. up against a very formidable tag team in the shape of Gallows and Anderson. And Chad Gable, American Alpha. And their opponent. Got to be ready, winning and Gable. Or will this win be too sweet? The only time, only time will tell. But right now, the coveted tag team titles are on the line. So, that five I do. Let's get these titles to the referee. Let's hold them up high. And let's get this match underway. Gallows versus Gallows and Anderson versus American Alpha. Carl Anderson and Jason Jordan to start us off. Here we go. Tag team match. Starting us off. Any big lift from Jason Jordan. Jason Jordan, a very powerful athlete. Both of these guys have a background in amateur wrestling. Of course, Chad Gable will compete in the Olympics. And yes, his name is Chad Gable, not Shorty G. We're not falling to WWE's BS, okay? That's not happening. Meanwhile, Carl Anderson showing a lot of aggression. We saw this a couple weeks ago with... Uh, Carl Anderson and Jason Jordan fighting, sorry, Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows fighting the Viking Raiders. These guys definitely put in some damage, but they did win by count out. So will we see some more dastardly tactics from the good brothers Gallows and Anderson? We're seeing a cover right now as Chad Gable enters the ring. Beautiful double Northern Light suplex from the two of these guys. Again, so adept in the art of amateur wrestling. If Kurt Angle was still in his prime, I'd definitely put these guys in Team Angle. But the sheer, for the sheer brute force of the Japanese style from Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows. And now the Doctor. Big LG is in the ring. Gable reverses the suplex attempts. Russian leg sweep. Now this is back in American Alpha's favour. I should also point out to you that uh, by the time it reaches destiny, um, Gallows and Anderson will have expired their contracts. Their contracts would have expired, and they have shown and they have chosen not to renew. So, in doing that, we will. Be seeing them compete in their final match at Destiny. The question is, against who? And will they go to Destiny as tag team champions? That is what we need to know. But in doing so, back to this match as Gallows throws Jason Jordan to the corner. And now Carl Anderson is coming in the ring here. Here we go, big knee strike. Gallows, avalanche in the corner. And now Jason Jordan needs to think about making the tag here. Definitely been worse for wear. As here comes Carl Anderson, the machine gun. These guys were members of the Bullet Club. Back in Japan, and again, cutting the half 
Cutting their half off the ring. Big boot there from Gallows. That is a smart thing to, uh, to do as a tag team. Isolate the weaker opponent and keep him in your half of the ring. Control the game. But Jason Jordan starting to get up a bit of steam here. Over belly to belly over the top rope. As here comes Jason Jordan now. Wrestling takedown. Now it's starting to work on the big Luke Gallows. Of course, here's a bit of nostalgia. Did you know that Lee Sorry, did you know that Luke Gallows was a part of the Straight Edge Society? Bet you didn't know that. That's a deep cut for you guys. There's a kick out of one there from Luke Gallows. Jason Jordan, of course, a prominent figure in his solo in his solo days in Velocity. For the OGs who've watched this since the beginning. And I mean the beginning, beginning. He was working at quite a bit of steam. But here we go. Jason Jordan once again. Kick out at one from Gallows. Gallows definitely appears to be weakened at the moment. Best thing would be to get him into the corner and tag Chad Gable in. Which is I think that's what they're doing. Here we go. Tag opportunity. And in comes. In comes Chad Gable. Takes the arm. Very smart strategy. And in comes Anderson. Gable's got to do something. And yes, he does. He shuts that hot tag down. Gallows is out. Anderson could be in trouble. No. Penalty kick to the back. And here we go again. Back to the corner. And now they're using the same strategy that the Good Brothers were using. Keep them in their half of the ring. Gallows is out at the moment. So this is a perfect opportunity for them to uh, exercise themselves. Let's say upon Carl Anderson. Carl Anderson managing to turn things around here. To the corner again. Gallows is just about getting up to his feet. And here comes Anderson. Anderson needs to the back to Jordan. Here we go again. Hottest tag team wrestling here on Velocity. As a big Larry there from Jason Jordan. Rocks Carl Anderson to the floor. And here we go. Another double team. This is excellent tag team strategy here from Gable and Jordan. Working on that leg. Here we go. Cover once again. One. Kick out at one. Again. And Anderson and Gallows trying to stay alive here. Gable managing to get Luke Gallows out of the way. But again, focusing on the wrong opponent. You should be focusing on who's in the ring with you. Schoolboy error there from Gable. As here comes Gallows. Sorry, Anderson with a dragon screw. And now it is back in the Good Brothers' favour. But again, Chad Gable reversing. Hip toss. Great strategy there. Great amateur wrestling. And once again, Gallows is in the ring. Big LG's in the ring. Oh my days! 6 8 shiz kids there from Gallows. But Gable pops right back up, tries the drop kick, misses. Lariat to the back of the head. He was just inches away from tagging. Jason Jordan. As here comes Gallows. Kick out at one by Gable. And now we see Gallows work on his opponent once again. Remember, keep your eye out as next the main event is happening Sonny Deville versus Becky Lynch German suplex attempt here German suplex attempt I was on about the main event but that's it German suplex we have new tag team champions great tag team match but that was something I wasn't expecting Chad Gable managing to hit the German suplex 
only gallows and it comes with the one two three how about that but either ways what a return to form Chad Gable and Jason Jordan are your new tag team champions and if anybody wants to step up to them you've got to be ready willing and Gable congratulations to the new tag team champions American Alpha they've worked so hard to get it and now this tag team division is getting spicier by the minute but keep an eye out because next is our main event Lynch versus DeVille no excuses no second chances well there is a second chance but can DeVille come out on top this time we'll find out now the following contest is for the brand new all improved Velocity Women's Championship look at it brand new title brand new title it probably sucks let me know what you think of it in the comments below but here we go introducing the competitors Sonya Deville the pride fighter up against the man Becky Lynch last week these two had a fantastic match both going at it hammer and tongue but Becky Lynch did come out on top Becky Lynch claiming that Sonny Deville wasted her opportunity that she's just making excuses Sonny Deville claiming that Becky's win was a fluke and then if she was to ever face her again it would be a different story well only time will tell let's give the championship to the referee both women know how much this means our main event the first time women have competed in the main event in velocity and it's for the richest prize in women's wrestling Sonya Deville Becky Lynch the crowd is electric tonight and here we go and these guys are not waiting for a little cup to collar and elbow tie up Sonya Deville taking Becky Lynch down straight away kick out before one what a lightning start to this match shining wizard from Deville elbow these girls are not wasting any time. Becky Lynch, Lariat outside the ring. This rivalry is starting to become more heated by the minute as Sonny Deville wrestles herself away from Becky Lynch. Becky Lynch gaining control of Sonny Deville once again. Smacking her head off the LED board. Referee's counting is up to four. And back in the ring we go. Lightning start to this match. Sunny Deville rolling out the way. Sliding knee strike. Leg. What a wonderful leg sweep. Again, as we say, Sunny Deville from Jersey. Very technical. Has a very dangerous striking offense, obviously, with that MMA background. And I'd also like to wish you guys a very happy Pride Month for everybody in the LGBT community. As we see one of the best do what she does best. Here comes Sonny Deville. Becky Lynch manages to get a kick. Crucifix there by Becky. I'm surprised she didn't go for a pin there. Could have, had, could have been a match. Knee drop. And now the match starts to go into Becky Lynch's hands. Went to go for a forearm. Be Becky gets hit with a kick. And now Sonny's offense. Her striking offense is paying dividends. She gets caught though. Judo takedown and a single leg Boston Crab is cinched in. Beware of Becky's technical offense. Very good with submissions, of course, that patented disarmor, which is a variation of the Fujiwara Ramba. Sonia looking for a suplex attempt. Becky blocking and delivering a suplex of her own. Here we go. Working on the arm once again controlling the arm key locking the arm that does very a lot of damage to the shoulder joint there and again going for a wrist lock and now here comes Sonny Deville relentless gut punches a 
Again, these women are going at it. Hammer and Song and the suplex delivered there from Sonya. The Pride Fighter is on fire. As here comes Sonya Deville, hit toss back into the ring. Now Sonya's going to take control here. Becky manages to wrestle herself free. To the corner, forearm from Lynch. And here comes Becky Lynch. This is the move she took Sonya out with. Backsploder! Backsploder connects. This could be it. She's looking for it. She's looking for it. The disarmer. No. Sonya manages to wrestle herself free. And here comes Sonya. Wrestling takedown. Now Sonya. The ball is back in your court. Here we go. Low kicks to the legs of Becky Lynch once again. That deadly striking offense is so deadly to anybody in the women's division. But Becky managing to get control. As here comes the man. Going up to the second rope. Armbar! Armbar attempt! This match is downright ugly. These women are not trying to go for a five-star instant classic. They're not trying to tear the house down. They're trying to tear each other apart here. Pedal to the metal from the get-go. As here comes Becky Lynch. Going up to the top rope. Is she going to hit that leg drop? No. Elbow drop. Sonya was able to roll out of the way. But in doing so, she jeopardized herself. And again, Becky Lynch to that previously injured arm there. Kick out at one there from Sonya Deville. And now the Jersey Devil has everything. And here we go. Here comes Sonya with the strikes. Oh my gosh. Becky has no answer. Suplex again by Sonya. But she's popped right back up. What a chop. Answers with a devastating chop. And now here comes Lynch. Stomp yet again to the arm. And here comes Lynch. Looking for the back slider. Once again. And we saw this before. It was one back exploder too much, which was Sonny Deville's fate last time. As could be the same again. One, two, kick out at two from Sonya. Yet another lifeline is being handed to Sonny Deville. As here comes Becky Lynch. She's setting it up. She's setting it up. Here we go, Disarmor. Disarmor. Will Becky tap, tap her out? No. Sonya managing to break free. Sonya's arm must be as feeling as fiery as Becky Lynch's hair. German suplex. And now Becky Lynch is raring to go. Sonya doesn't look like she knows what hit her. Becky Lynch missing with the clothesline there. And Sonya managing to duck out the way. And once again, managing to move out the way. Back and forth with these women. What a main event. As Becky works towards the legs here. Becky tired as ever. Sonya tired as ever. Who will capitulate in this match? As Becky goes for the cover. One. Kick out at one by Sonya. What resiliency. As here comes Becky once again. European uppercut. And again the attack to the arm. This could be it here. So you're looking. Here we go. Leg drops. And here for that 180. Sonia moves out the way. Moves out the way. Here comes Sonia. Spine buster. That's her version of the spine buster. She calls it the pride buster. Boom. Sonia. Oh my god. I don't believe that. Sonya Deville just beat the champ. She said it. She said the second time there would be no mistakes. And she's the new women's champion. And now she's going to let Becky know about it. Referee, get in there. What an end to this episode of Velocity. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining me. Leave a like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. What will be now the future of the women's division?